UDSS uses the maker education approach in the school ALP within the lower set curriculum. The SET 1 students have the opportunity to develop computational thinking and the SET 2 students go through design thinking process. They get to choose the group of users they want to help and they think of solutions to help make their lives better. People on wheelchairs have difficulties reaching out for stuff on the tables, so we made this manual pull extendable arm. Students design things like the automated dog feeder, automated watering device, as well as the smart vacancy monitoring systems in restaurants. So through that, we see our students growing their social competencies to become empathetic citizens as well as ethical advocates. This vending machine will like dispense drinks. The can goes in there, it will get stopped by the lever over here. After we press the button, it will drop. The lever will close and pushes the can out. It looks very simple, but I had to go through a lot of codes to run and run over again before it actually starts working. So when my project started to fall apart a few days before the submission day, we had to redo everything and it was a very stressful situation. But we managed to do it because we split our work to different parts and I learned that teamwork was very important. I failed many times because I realised that the arm was a bit too big for the elderly and another difficulty that I faced was that uh, I realised that this arm was not soft enough for the elderly. This is the finalised size and I went with covering the surface with foam. Students feedback that they enjoy the process of design, thinking and making. Sometimes they will request for a sensor that even the teachers are not familiar with. And together, we will work with the students to come up with the solutions. And when something works, okay, the joy is not just from the students, the teachers celebrate their success too. Through the designing, I can work my brain and think of different ways to improve the product. And while looking at the finalised product, I feel very proud of myself because I've been through a lot of hard work and a lot of thinking to make sure that this product can have the potential to help uh, real-world problems. Our longer-term vision is for students to tap on the student-initiated learning that happens during the home-based learning time and to ideate and then bring their ideas to life through the making process.